I killed another one! Hello there everyone and welcome back to Heavy Rain. I'm really looking forward to getting back into this because things are getting really messed up. Oh, it's gonna be great! Oh, hello Ethan. How you doing, sunshine? <laughs> you ready for another fun day with Mikado? We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna save your son, isn't that right, Ethan? Yes. We're gonna save him. We're not gonna let him die. Oh, there he is! He's being sad already! Oh, look at how sad he is! Why? <laughs> Why do you keep coming back? Why do you keep coming back, love? Ethan... Are you alright? I failed the trial. I was supposed to- And let me guess, if he man. killed him, he'd be in the corner going, I killed a man! I couldn't do it. No, you, you just the failed the prompts. You're not responsible for those murders. I can prove it. Oh, prove it time. That changes nothing. My son's got to die. Saving Sean is all that matters now. Why? Why are you stroking him? No. No. I should have let you die, Madison. No kiss, no kiss, no kiss, no kiss, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. We're not having no sex scene. No, we're not I, doing it. I, um, get out of here. He's doing this alone. I'm, I'm gonna go. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> He's not a lied happiness, Madison. <laughs> I've no more business here. I'm going home. Yeah! And that's probably her under the story, baby. I actually don't know. <laughs> the playthrough I saw, they slept together, so this is, uh... This is new territory for me. Fantastic. Oh, it's the Kappas! It's Blake! Hey, Blake! No, don't go back to warn him. Just leave, get on your bike. Cops. They're looking for Ethan. Why do you care? It looks like a raid. Why do you care? <laughs> Let's let him get caught, come on. No. If this is one of those time things we're letting it happen, he's getting caught. <laughs> Bye, Ethan. <laughs> so long, sucker. Leave. <laughs> oh Madison. Oh, you wanted to sleep with him, and now you're just like, bye! <laughs> He's so mean! Don't move! <gasps> He's been captured again? <laughs> oh, this is amazing! I didn't know we could get caught again! How's he gonna get out of this one? No. We're not resisting arrest. <laughs> John! <laughs> I need to save Sean! So how's the, how's the ending gonna happen? If he's in jail. Hmm. There's no one to bust him out. The cop that busted me out last time... He's dead. <laughs> so, I'm genuinely curious, where's this going? <laughs> Am I gonna get a really bad ending where I'm just in jail? That'd be great. <laughs> get into that cell. You gotta save him! Please! Save my son! No! I beg you, you're his last chance. Who's he talking to? Save my son. There's no one there, Ethan. I'm not gonna save your son. <laughs> I don't know why I find his misery so funny. <laughs> I'm, am I a twisted person? I think I'm a bad person. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was worth the loading screen. It was longer than the goddamn scene. <laughs> Oh, Scotty boy, I didn't mean to turn you around, so... <laughs> Why is he doing that? <laughs> yes, I know where he lives. <laughs> Lord? Oh! I'm sorry, Scott. Is she here? <gasps> you should have listened to me, Mr. Shelby. Uh-oh. <laughs> I told you to drop the investigation. No. Your son is a serial killer. How many people does he have to kill before you- Can I get Shelby Lord killed? His faults, but he's still my son. How many characters can I get killed before you the end? <laughs> Mr. Shelby, you can't possibly understand. You leave me no choice. Who? Oh. Your investigation is over. For good. Am I underwater? Uh-oh. 
<laughs> oh, she's there too? Can I leave her? <laughs> Why is that my first thought? I'm tempted just to sit here. I'm tempted just to sit here. Okay, I'm gonna see how long I can sit here. <laughs> yeah, I think this is a fake drama scene. I don't think anything's gonna happen. <laughs> I turned the lights on, wonderful. Now I can see what I'm doing. What am I doing now? Turn the radio on? <laughs> what is he trying to do, burn his ropes off? That's gonna hurt. <laughs> You're gonna die, Shelby. Oh. Yeah, there was no rush. I just sat there for a while. Nothing really happens. Can I just go past her and just leave? Come on, go kick. Shelby, kick. Shelby, kick. Come on. Shelby, kick. Alright, so long, Lauren. I have a choice. I'm taking you with me. Bye, love. <laughs> I'm such a dick. Wow, Shelby. <laughs> I actually left her. Oh, wow. Shelby, you just, uh... You just didn't even try. <laughs> was she already dead? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, angry Shelby is angry. Oh, am I going to drive in there? Oh, ho, ho, ho. If I got my gun. Am I going to go kill him? Here I go, kill him again. <laughs> going to kill you. Oh. Oh my god! Oh my god, Shelby! <laughs> Shelby's going nuts! <laughs> oh, oh, I won't kill everyone in this building. I got my gun. Shelby's got a gun. <laughs> oh my god, he is! Shelby! Oh, I, okay, it's killing time. <laughs> Does this always happen? Does Shelby always go on a killing spree? Ah, bam! Everybody dies! <laughs> Toy of the month, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Stop quoting Rick and Morty, but... It's <laughs> on my mind recently. Saw the ending there. Oh, so good. I don't know how many bullets I have. <laughs> Bam! Bam! Shelby <laughs> ain't taking no shit. Holy Moses. <laughs> and you! <laughs> he wasn't running. Why did he... Why did he jump up like that? Bam! Bam! <laughs> Bam! Where are you? Where? Don't come near me. <laughs> of course, he's a wuss when he's actually confronted with violence. Oh, fucking asshole. Time to die. Please. Don't. Nope. <laughs> this is fun. So sorry. <laughs> Lauren is dead. You fucking killed Stop. her. Stop. I beg you. <laughs> no. Punch him again. <sighs> chuck him. Chuck him. Chuck him. Chuck him. Shall we? Oh, that got calm all of a sudden. No, no, he's innocent. He's not a killer. <laughs> not a killer. You are though. Die. Oh. Stick him in the saber tooth thing. Come on. You're a fucking liar. Now tell me the truth. No, no, please, don't hurt me. <laughs> Last chance. This is the daddy we were supposed to be scared know. of. I swear, I don't know anything. 
Get him again! <laughs> Just keep smacking onto that desk. Stop! Stop! I beg you. No! I'll tell you everything. Nope. Don't wanna know. Oh, it wouldn't let me choke him. Uh, Gordy. <sighs> Gordy Disappointed. Always his fun, you know. He wanted to to be like the origami killer. Copycat. Got it. He kidnapped that kid and he held him under the water for a little too long. It was an accident. An unfortunate accident. He kidnapped the kid. That's not an accident. He wanted to play. He told me everything. He was crying. He was so sorry for what had happened. Didn't seem it that way whenever I was talking to him. What the hell are you talking about? Gordy. Gordy is my son. And now you're going to die for him. Shoot him, shall we? Don't you walk away after killing all those guards. What? Oh, dear. That boy, Gordy killed. No one will miss him. The street trash, like so many others. Bang. Oh. Come on. You disgusting pile of shit. Do you realize how many people are killed coming in here? John Shepard. What about John Shepard? Why did you put flowers on his I, grave? I own the construction site where he died. Mm. I never forgot. I've been putting flowers so, on his grave for 30 years. So, you felt guilty about the kid? But you don't feel kil guilty about him? killing two people? I don't know. What? He was adopted, I think. And you don't feel guilty about it's the street it. trash? But you feel guilty about this kid. Her name is Anne. Anne Shepard. What? That don't make no sense. Those conflict with each other, sir. She was just a whore. Oh, you're gonna die. Come and work on me, Shelby. I'll pay you well. You even have all the girls you want. Oh boy. Never say her name again. You hear me? Never. Kill him. Don't you walk away. Kill him. Well, the music's flaring up. Can I kill him? Uh-oh, he's reaching. My heart. <laughs> he's having a heart attack. <laughs> I need my pills. In that drawer. There. Oh, do you now? Catch you later. <laughs> no, you're leaving. Shelby. <laughs> Hmm. Well, that went well. I'm a good guy. Wait, what could you possibly have to do with the story anymore? You've left so many times. Is she gonna get him out of jail? Oh, please, that'd be contrived. It's Friday now. Okay. 4.998 inches. She's outshining everybody so far. Why is she going to... Unless... No, there's no way the cop survived that shot. Did he? Shepard. Hello, I'm looking for Anne Shepard's room. Oh, the Please mom? The, visitor's book. the mom's alive? Find it with your real name, Madison. Are you a member of the family? Yeah, you could say that. No, oh, you couldn't. She'll be pleased to have a visitor. No one ever comes to see her. With the Alzheimer's, she has trouble remembering things, but it'll still please her, you know. Oh. It's room 19 at the end of the corridor. What a shame I'm using Thank her. You. I'm probably going to drag up traumatic shit. I'm a bad person. <laughs> Everybody in this story just... They're just terrible people. <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Shepard. Is it time for my pills already? No, Mrs. Shepard, I... They're never on time with my pills. I don't know what they do here. In the other hospital, they were always on time. But here... Maybe you just don't remember because you have Alzheimer's? Is that what they're doing? No, let's be rude. Ask I came to talk about your son, Mrs. Shepard. You won't remember me anyway. What's the point in introducing? No son? I have no son. You have two sons. Or I had two sons. I've got one son. John. Do you remember John? My Johnny... He is a good little boy, you know. Your other son? son, Mrs. Shepard, John's twin brother. What was his name? But they were twins? What other son? I have no other son. I never had any children. Uh, hmm. Carnaby Square. 
I think I used to live there a long time ago. We didn't Just have different much places money to lean on. Time, you know. We had to make do with very little. I think your son is in trouble, Mrs. Shepherd. He's done some terrible things. Tell me the truth, old lady. Come on. I need to find him. Do you understand? What sort of picture is that? Terrible that picture doesn't have like a me. tip to pour, like the liquid. He never came to see me. Can you believe it? In ten years. It's perfect never. cylinder. <laughs> no one forgets their mother, do they? Do you have my pills? It's time for my pills. Give her some Tic Tacs or something. I don't know. Mrs. Shepard, your son may be linked to a series of murders. Come on, Perhaps lady. You have some information that could help the investigation. Move this scene along already. Are you a new nurse? I get it. Where you want your pills. pills. I asked them for a television, you know. They said I didn't have enough money. It's a pity. I'm fond of television. Uh, that's all the questions. Um, she told me nothing. Nothing. Yes. A book. And paper. Blank. Oh, am I going to fold it into an origami thing? Show it to her and that's going to remind her of her son, the killer. Okay. Okay. I see now why I had to look through the stupid book. There you go. There's your stupid origami thing. I remember your son, the killer. I love origami. But that's not my favorite one. What is? Uh, uh, fucking bitch. <laughs> fucking bitch. That's not my favorite one. Oh, you know how to do these little dogs, too. Little doggy. My children loved origami. Oh, is this your favorite one? I taught them how to do it. John loved the little dogs. And then I left him at home with my drunk and abusive Max. son. Max? Son? Max, Max. Husband. <laughs> all dogs with the same name. I was wasting my time telling him they couldn't all have the same name. But he always wanted his paper dogs Max. It's funny, isn't it? Hilarious. My little paper animals. They played with them for hours. I showed my boys how to make them, you know. Boys, eh? As in plural? Boys, Mrs. Shepherd. John and... What was your other son's name again? My other son? I only had one son. My little Johnny. I don't think this bitch has Alzheimer's. I think she's just fucking with me at this point. <laughs> I'm going to go to the bathroom. Take a shower. I'm gonna make sure my face looks lovely. Yeah. I killed a man yesterday. Yeah. Look pretty though. Flowers? You don't seem to get many flowers, Mrs. Shepherd. No, but I love them. My saw flowers in the hall. Flowers. I know he'll bring me some. Yoink. There's your stupid flower lady. What like a mom. lovely orchid. My sons loved orchids. Sons. I used to grow them in the back. When John died, I laid orchids on his grave. Anything in the drawers that will trigger a memory? There's a picture. Are these your children, Mrs. Shepherd? John and his brother? Is that them? Give me the name! They're good little boys. Their father never looked after them. Always drinking. They didn't have an easy life, you know. No. Where were you during this time? I cried when they told me. I'd already lost one of my children, and now they were taking away another one, you understand. Oh, for adoption? Yeah, yeah. The foster family, Mrs. Shepherd. What was the name of the foster family that adopted John's brother? The reason that this scene is annoying me so much is that I already know the They're answer, you know? They're very nice people. <laughs> so I'm just I like, them, you know. I'm waiting for a reveal I already know, but in maybe this is more, I used to go and you know, see my little boy. dramatic and tense for you guys and that I haven't I seen this before. I got sick and I couldn't go any longer. Perhaps he thought I'd forgotten him. Perhaps. He must have thought I didn't love him anymore. What was the name? His name, Mrs. Shepherd. What was his name? But I loved him. Oh, I hate you. 
If you only knew how much I missed him. I am three he seconds said, away from putting a pillow over your face, love. Was what was the name? <laughs> Come closer. And she's gonna bite me in the neck. Yes. <gasps> I wonder what she whispered. Ethan? It was Ethan all along. Blake? It was Blake all along. Shelby? It was Shelby all along. It was it was Mr. Burns all along. <laughs> Wheelan Smithers is the killer. <laughs> Whoa! Watch out there, love. You almost knocked her down. I'm actually... Kind of curious what she learned to shock her so much there because I know the answer and it shouldn't be like, you know, shocking to her. She doesn't know the person as far as I'm aware. Oh wait, they're actually showing the scene where the kid died? I thought they didn't have the guts. Oh, hurry. Oh, hurry. <laughs> hurry, my totally American brother. <laughs> Go save my brother, who I know is going to die because I've seen the future, so this is really not very tense. Seriously, <laughs> I know he's dead. So. <laughs> Let me guess, the dad doesn't help. And the kid dies. Almost as if the gravekeeper told me he couldn't get help. Oh, wow. He's gonna die, Daddy! My Daddy's drunk. He's not gonna help me. I'm gonna go back and my brother be dead. Sucks, brother. <laughs> Wait, well, how is he dying? Is he just dead now? <laughs> How did he die? <laughs> His head was still above water. He's not dead. Did he just? <laughs> did he just go? <laughs> Did he die of a broken heart like fucking Padme? What the fuck? <laughs> His face was still above water when they were talking. <laughs> he wasn't dead. <laughs> this looks awful. Tears. We killed a lot of people today, Shelby. A lot of people indeed. And Lauren's dead. And you're alone. And matches. Burn! That was a pretty bad looking fire. Well, what are you doing, Shelby? What, what, what you doing? the letter you got. Oh, and the fire goes. Why, why, why is it burning evidence? What's, uh, what's going on? Is my coy thing getting annoying yet? I, I'm just waiting for you to sort of like put it together what he's doing. Your box. Collecting evidence and burning it. I would, uh. What shall we be doing there? Because he's sad. Because he misses Lauren that much. 
That he, just, that he feels it's not worth it? I feel like just letting this scene play out. Here it is. Right. Do you remember the timing I was telling you about? With the clocks and the ding ding ding? Yeah, that doesn't make no sense, does it? Look how much time he spends back here. <laughs> Look how much time he spent back there, like... And I was like... <laughs> There's no way he did that in that time. So stupid! So, as you can clearly put together, Shelby's a murderer. Shelby is the origami killer. <laughs> Which is why her telling that to that reporter lady is like, why would... Why would that shocker, Scott Shelby's name being told? It's like, oh, that guy, that guy I've never met. And I shouldn't possibly know about Oh, boy. Yeah. So it's a pretty stupid reveal, isn't it? Shelby's behind it all. Wait. Is she about to break into Shelby's apartment? Oh, this is gonna go well. For Shelby. Seriously, how does she just know where people are? How does she know to come here? She's magic. She just knows where to go. Oh, this is fucking boring. <laughs> oh, this is just pointless busy work. Up and down, up and down. Look at that. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> there we go. And then... Uh, you touch, girl. Yes, you have. Because you failed a couple of times. Now, Shelby, show up and kill her. Wait, was this before I got home? Shelby got home, I mean. Add that in here. That's where the smell of burning comes from. Oh, evidence going up. It's after. Smoke. Yeah, there goes all the evidence. That sucks. Oh, she wasn't even looking at that. Did you see that, Shelby? A cop's uniform. Always trust a cop. That's why children went with him. He was dressed as a cop. Yes, that makes sense, sure. This one got a false back? That sounded different. Ooh. What's in here? I really don't remember this. There's the old school typewriter. Uh oh. Mars. oh the lunatic's been watching him drown. Some kind of a well filling up with rain, slowly drowning him. Shit, it needs a password. Of course it does. Try Orchid. Damn it. Uh, try John. Uh, Max? Got it. Okay. Max. The name John gave to his paper dogs when he was a child. Sure. What the hell is that? Thanks for that expedition dump, love. An address. It's gotta be where Sean Mars is. <laughs> Hurry. There's no time to lose. Ethan went through all his trials and I find it. That's hilarious. <laughs> Just like, hey, 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 it's mine. I got the address. I'll save you, son. No, you won't. You're gonna fail. <laughs> You're gonna fail badly. Little mouse one. Squeak, squeak. Take your time. Not a drowning kid or anything. Oh, Shelby! So you found my little secret. Hey, Shelby. Over, Scott. All those children killed just to find a father capable of saving his son. Shut up! Oh. You don't understand. Tell her, Shelby. Shoot her. There's one child left. There might still be time to save him. Let him go. No. Do what your father couldn't do. No. Get 
How is this going to end? I guess I'm gonna have to break out somehow. But if he gets arrested in the scene where he's in the cells and the cop's dead and she can die earlier, what would the ending have been? That wardrobe had like a pretty bad back to it in the other room. Maybe I can bust through. There we go. Oh shit, he set the apartment on fire! Can I let her die here? Hmm. <laughs> it's very tempting. Let's see if she can die here. Cough, cough, cough. Three. Yep. <laughs> All right, it was the left one. The left one. That's it. Let's see if we can't get her killed in the fire. <laughs> I'm sorry, Madison. This is the end for you now. Can't have you showing up and see if an Ethan. I want to see what happens if you die and Ethan's in jail. I'm assuming Sean just dies. <laughs> Choices matter, that's what I know. Right? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put her right in the middle of the flames if I can, and then uh, get her killed. <laughs> One burn. <laughs> Put her on fire. I walked her into the fire. <laughs> oh no! Oh, I'm sorry, Madison. I don't think that's how fire works, by the way. <laughs> that's such a bad fire effect. Hooray! Madison's dead! <laughs> I killed another one! <laughs> I always said she was a very hot lady. But she took it a bit literally. <laughs> oh, what an explosive exit from the game. Oh boy. Oh, now I get to play as Sean. Does Sean have to save himself if everybody's not there, if everybody fails? Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> Bye, Sean. <laughs> I can't believe that fire effect on Madison. There's no one here to confront him. Ethan's in jail. Madison's dead, the cop's dead, Blake's incompetent. <laughs> Shelby's the bad guy. You're fucked, Sean. You're dead. Is that it? No, it was. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. Sean's dead. <laughs> People think he's still the origami killer. Amazing, he's in jail. And he is believed to have a serious psychiatric condition. In a related tragedy, it was learned that the investigation has cost the life of Madison Page. Who? Oh, she was a reporter. <laughs> That's right. And she's dead. <laughs> she burnt to death. This is an ending I've never seen. I didn't know he could end up in jail. Just making origami figures, going nuts. He's got a little stool, is he gonna hang himself? He's got a little stool. Is he gonna step on the little stool? Oh. Oh. 
His head bopped against the rope. He can't even hang himself correctly. <laughs> Be laughing at this, especially considering I know someone who's well knew someone who did this. <laughs> I really don't give a shit about Ethan. Goodbye, Ethan. How did he get the rope? Like a full-on rope. Journalist Madison Page was laid to rest in Charity Cross Cemetery. <laughs> Death while investigating the heroic! Mars has made a lasting impression on the whole country. No one knows that it was heroic. She didn't really report much, except for some random dude saying she was going to look into stuff. And then she burnt to death, Brittany. Okay, Brittany. It's a wrap. Great. Let's get out of here. All this hokey clap cups made me hungry. Oh, she didn't care. Wow, Madison literally gets disrespected in death. Amazing. <laughs> He's being buried in two days in some godforsaken hole in the back end of beyond. Thought you resigned. I have to attend as a matter of protocol. I'll pass. Jane and I didn't see eye to eye on much. You resigned. I understand. Hey, sir. I still have his glasses. What should I do with him? Well, you won't be needing them again. Hey, you stick them and the drugs, Blake. It'll be hilarious. Come on, put them on. Go on. What stupid shit's gonna be on the goggles? Is this like, is this like consciousness gonna be uploaded to them? And he's gonna be like, hey, Blake. <laughs> I'm in your brain now. Oh, he didn't put them on. Never mind. Oh, go on, Blake. Go on, try him. See how it screws with your head. Go on. Put on the future glasses, Blake. Come on. It's gotta be dumb. They're building up to something. Oh, look at him, he's so happy. Look at that. Oh, look at, look at the AI. Oh, or the AR. Oh, look at his big goofy smile. I wonder if this is the last background you use in the last scene. Because this is the last one I use. That'd be a neat detail if it was. <laughs> he's literally not doing anything, just going. <clears throat> oh my god, I was joking! My consciousness is in the glasses. I don't know what that means. If someone breaks the glasses, do I die? Am I in a network? These glasses weren't explained, so I don't actually know. Who are we following now? Everybody else is dead. Shelby, maybe? Oh! Shelby's going on the prowl. It's raining. Wait, is it just going to pan away? Shoes are still hot. Well, that's the best ending I could have possibly gotten. I want to see them again. I'm a father too. <laughs> well, he didn't do that. <laughs> oh, yes! Right, yes, yes, yes. I said I would explain this throughout the credits. Right. So, the thing that was cut out from the game was that Shelby and Ethan had this sort of psychic connection that Shelby was at the crosswalk. We didn't get to see the scene. He was there and saw Sean jump out to save his son. And that created a psychic connection between the two of them. So whenever he would go out killing, um, he would, like, black out. So that's why he thought he was the origami killer. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> oh boy like it makes no sense like people like said this game was amazing when it came out and uh, look at all the things I could have done <laughs> but I was like no snap it <laughs> um yeah it's it was just 
It was just bad. I just thought it was bad from the get-go. <laughs> Guess we'll just watch this and see what we could have done. We could have been cool cop but not got run over. Could have been on the run from the cops. Didn't do that. We did do this, because we had no choice. I guess you can do it without being so slutty, because her skirt was longer there. Well, that was something else. David Cage, you're a weird, weird fella. And you make weird games. Um, we'll definitely have to check out another David Cage game. I never finished Indigo Prophecy, did I? Um, and there's Beyond Two Souls and a whole bunch of other interesting ones to check out. Um... I know this took a long time for me to get around to completing. Uh, if you've been following the series, I'd like to apologize again for that. My system just wasn't able to handle, for some reason, some of the scenes. Um, now that the PC is all upgraded, we're, we're all golden. We're all golden. Um, but let's just see if we can skip this. I don't think we can. I guess all there is to do, for now, is wait and see if there's anything at the end of the credits. <laughs> I really shouldn't laugh at that. I'm so childish. I just saw a name called Wang Lo. So I was just like, hey. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, is that it? Are we done? Any after credits thing? Nope, that's it. This is the finale, guys. This is it. It's done. We completed it. I guess maybe one day in the future we could go through this again. Maybe. I don't know. Take it seriously or try to get different people killed and other people survive. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm pretty satisfied with how this went. <laughs> um, so I'd like to thank y'all very much for watching. And as always, I'll see all you beautiful people next time. Bye-bye!